Without it, there is no life. It delivers all, everything we need. It, it keeps us going. It's the life-giving pump. But when that pump has problems, families uh, rush their children here to a place many call a hospital within a hospital. We stay very busy. It's a lot of work to be doing, but uh, we've got good help. It is the heart center at Arkansas Children's Hospital, and its daily rhythm can be dizzying. 10,000 EKGs a year, 8,000 outpatient visits, and more than 600 surgeries. Getting the job done, dozens of nurses and doctors. We are really very much like a family. Using the latest treatments and technologies, all working to save one tiny organ. The heart of a baby is about this, just a little bit larger than a walnut. It's probably uh, somewhere between a walnut and a small lemon. Survival rates and government studies tell the same story, that the Heart Center at Children's is one of the nation's best. Among the best children's hospital in the country. Down here, we are making a difference. But it hasn't always been that way. You know what kind of beer that is? Oh. It's called a koala beer. When Dr. Tommy Dungan began his work on kids' hearts almost half a century ago, cardiac care in Arkansas really lacked even the basics. Not very good. The patient rooms in the pediatric ward was not, were not air conditioned. The more complex the case, the simpler his advice. Get that baby warm, get in the car and head for Houston, Texas. But today it's just the opposite. We have had leaders in the field uh, leading this hospital. We recruited over the years uh, wonderful doctors. Instead of sending the sickest children out of state, surgeons like Jonathan Drummond Webb now operate on many patients from outside Arkansas. Kids out of Mississippi, Louisiana, Oklahoma. Now we don't have to send any child uh, out of state for anything. But if you think the center's leaders are satisfied, think again. The hospital just became a regional hub for a groundbreaking and potentially life-saving new heart pump and surgeons are waiting for the first child who needs it. This is the size of the pump that we can put into the child and we can support them. So instead of having this whole big console and pumps and pneumatic devices pumping away or miles and miles of circuitry going, we sort it out with this. This is a great step for us at this institution. A place where every day the latest technologies mix with the human side of medicine. Here's one of those butterfly stickers, there you go. With one purpose in mind, to mend the tiniest hearts and save the youngest lives.